Seven mistakes that you can make when staging a home. Hello everyone, my name is Fadi Kudair. I'm a local realtor here in Ottawa with Sutton, Ottawa. Please follow and subscribe so you can get more videos like this. If you like what you see, please don't forget to hit the like button at the end. Mistake number one, hanging pictures or mirrors way too high. One of the biggest things that we've noticed when staging a home is uh, folks end up hanging the pictures a little bit too high and it becomes a little bit eyesore, if you will, because you're not able to kind of just see it properly. You got to make sure that you're hanging the photos and, and pictures at an eye level. That way, pleasant sort of experience when someone is walking in the door and they can actually imagine themselves living there. Mistake number two, short curtains. I hate short curtains. The biggest thing when you hang in curtains, you got to make sure to take measurements for the curtains from the, from the ceiling all the way to the floor. That way that they're not dangling, they're not hanging. They're just about the right place. doesn't have to be custom. But a lot of the places such as uh, home hardware or Walmart, what have you, will be able to kind of get you the curtains that you're looking for. A lot of them are standard, but just make sure you measure it properly. Mistake number three, small area rugs. What I find a lot of the times when people are trying to uh, outfit the place, they, put, they end up putting small area rugs, and that's not really helpful as it doesn't really cover the space properly. You got to set it up in such a way that it actually takes the, you know, it, it sets up properly, especially under the couches and what have you. Maybe have the couch, the edges of the couch laying on it. So it, it brings up a little bit more of a statement. Mistake number four. Grouping items all together on a mantle or uh, just above the fireplace. A lot of the times when it comes to design, you really have to just make sure that it keep it very simple and very easy. When you're setting up items like this and you're trying to stage, the less the better. So maybe three or four items, two or three items, if you will, and just make sure that they, know they have a little bit of different heights and what have you, and they sit properly on one edge of the mantle and they leave the rest of it so it's a little bit easier to see and you're kind of providing the space and making it look very simple. Which brings me to number five, too cluttered of a house or too cluttered of a space, if you will. Uh, a lot of the times folks, when they're trying to stage and they're trying to kind of put the house on the market, what they'll end up doing is they don't clutter, declutter, if you will, properly, which basically creates the sense of chaos in the home and it doesn't really look presentable. And what that does, it just kind of takes away the, 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 the look and the feel uh, that people want to see the space. It doesn't really, it just takes away from the space itself and the focus becomes more on the item. Mistake number six, a huge contrast in the age of the items that you're putting in. So one of the biggest things that we notice a lot of the times is that you're putting in pillows or you're leaving certain couches or what have you, and some of these items are outdated. Biggest thing that you could do is to leave something outdated, especially when you're staging it properly and you're putting in new, new stuff. You know, take it out, take out that old pillow, maybe throw a nice blanket instead nice cream blanket on the edge of the couch, make it look presentable. The simpler, the better. Mistake number seven, too many area rugs and runners. This is my biggest pit peeve, especially when you're coming into the house. You don't want to be seeing too many runners and too many little area rugs. The idea is to be able to see the floor and to find out what's going on with the floor. And even if the floor does have a little bit of falls, at least be able to kind of showcase the home. For more tips like this, guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to hit the like button so we can get more and more videos like this. And if you'd like to see more videos like that, don't forget to subscribe and follow my channel. Thanks again.